All right, today I'm gonna to talk to you about the high definition 1080p DVR backup camera from Yakari or Yakari, I'm not sure which one it is. Uh, this thing you can record um, the images from off the back of the RV or wherever you have it set up, you can record them, play them back on your computer or you can play them back on the setup here. It comes with the, the seven inch display here and it's not a complete um, unboxing video. It's more of like a semi install video. The camera's already mounted on the back. The one thing I will say though, is when you do get your package, make sure you read the uh, manual here. Trust me, you wanna read everything that's inside here. So I'll get to installing the camera first. All right, so if you have a, a Jayco that's pre-wired to install a camera, this originally comes with a, a plug on the inside. So if you use a Furion camera, it'll plug right in, but I don't have a Furion, so I had to splice into these wires. It's not too bad. Plus it's better than trying to tap into the uh, running lights up there. So the hardest part is getting the first screw in, but once you get that in, it's pretty easy. Just one screw on each of the four corners, two on top and then two on the bottom down here. And then now uh, you can adjust the camera with the little, uh, what is it, Allen keys on the side, on both sides. <clears throat> and so here you can adjust the brightness up or if you're night driving or whatever, you can turn it all the way down. Also, there's a menu option here where you can scroll through there. You can record your backup, you can play it back again, and you can come in here and set your system preferences when you come over here to uh, system camera setup. That's not the four corners of what you see in the back. That's actually four different cameras. You can hook up four different cameras in here. So you have one screen up here, one screen over here, one here, and one here. Um, and then the mode, if, uh, if for some reason you, you mounted the camera upside down, you can use this here and that'll flip it uh, left to right. And then this one will flip it horizontal. And then uh, again, you can go to picture here, and that's what uh, that's where you can select your brightness, contrast, and everything. When you come over here to pairing, if you get an additional camera, this is where you want to go. You come here and you hit pairing. When you get this out of the box, it's already paired, so you don't have to do anything. All right, it comes with two different mounting options, the kind to where you screw it into the top of your dash if you wanna do that. Otherwise, it comes with this little bracket right here. You just put some double side tape that comes with it, put that on the bottom and stick it right down. And it seems to work pretty good on uh, the F350 anyways. It's out of the way and it's still solid. And that's, that's about all there is to it. Really easy to set up. I think it took me maybe 15 minutes to get, the, get it wired up into the back and then it didn't take nothing to hook up to the front because uh, all you gotta do is plug it in down here to your USB or to your uh, cigarette lighter and then you just hit power and then that'll turn it on up here. So it's actually very easy, very simple. 